She's the nation's top law enforcement officer and is overseeing the FBI's investigation of the murders of 49 people and the wounding of 53 others inside Pulse. Attorney General Loretta Lynch spent some time at the memorial inside Orlando City Hall as part of her visit. We stand with you to say that the good in this world far outweighs the evil. At a news conference at the federal courthouse, the AG announced that the Justice Department is making $1 million available to cover overtime for public safety personnel and is continuing to provide victim and first responder counseling to help Orlando heal. And what the American people have seen in the wake of this horrific assault is a message of determination to remove hatred and intolerance from our midst, to live our lives freely and without fear, and to stay true to the principles of liberty, justice, and equality that define America at our best. The AG would not say if shooter Omar Mateen's wife will be charged, nor would she give specifics as to why Mateen was investigated previously by the FBI, but still allowed to buy guns. We are going back and looking at all of our contacts with him, as we are asking people to look back at their contacts with him as well, to determine what, if anything, we could have done better. So it's too early to say right now, we're looking at all of that.